Welcome, welcome, welcome YouTubers to another edition of Dan Sinclair Interviews. So go and big up yourself Dan Sinclair my brother and big up yourself Unruly Cooley. I'll be your host for today, Shawnee T, right? So people, who we have here for the new year? Yeah, exclusively yours. We have the Silver Lynx crew. So to my right, we have Mikey. Then we have the selector extraordinaire, MJ. And then we have the data selector, Ayla. Yeah? So, we're just going to fire through some questions, okay? okay. Keep it moving. Fire. Okay, so let me, let me start with you, Mikey. So tell me, where, where, where you was born and where, where you come from, B? I'm originated in Jamaica, you know. Okay. Jamaica. Yeah. A place called Spanish Town. Yeah, no, I'm my yeah. place that still. Okay. okay. Mm. And we're, we're, we're in Spanish Town, I don't say. Spanish Town, yeah. Uh, if Spanish Town, um, there's a place called Wolaba Road or Wolaba. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah Wolaba yeah. Road, on okay. the side there. Eh? Nice. Yeah, that's nice. My, uh, okay. okay. So, and w so when did you come to England, B? Well, I came in 2002 still. Okay. 2002. Yeah. Um, How do you find it when you come to England? It's a bit rough, you know. Yeah. Rough. As I said to anybody, you know, uh, don't don't think it's a better road. It's, mm. it's rough, but yeah. you just have to fight, you know. Yeah. Because if you if you them say if you want good, you know what's after one. Okay. And, you know, it's a, rough, it's a battlefield, but you have to just fight. Okay. Definitely. So, when you were, and I know, see, you, you're the selector for the sound, one of the selectors. Was you, was you making music back in, in Jamaica? Was you selecting back in Jamaica? Yeah, I used to select back home. I used to select a song they call Little Melody. Okay. Mm, very, very, when I said melody, proper melody, when you hear that playing, it's like, yeah. Okay. If you, if you, sound system. Yeah. I, mean, I, I, was, I was one of the top man on the sound as well. So. Okay. So what, what era was that? Was that just of like a, like a just spinning? Musical, yes. Spin and suck. Uh, any artist was on the sound? Artists like yeah, like no, no, like no, no, not, no. not from them time there when you used to have say like Jara with 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 Super Cat and okay, early okay, not from not from them times. Nah, 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 okay, nah, from a later nah, era. Nah, nah, nah. Okay. Just just me and my cousin used to play it still. Okay. Yeah, we never took up the artist side of Okay. Okay. Is the clash over there? Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Ne never last one now. No? No, never last one. <laughs> never last one. And, and I mean, I, I didn't have plenty clash, but when we do have clash, I prepared myself. Okay. And them time used to use vinyl. Uh, you understand? And again, I was I was the the beast. Yeah. So when any clash pop up, I have to be there. So you know, mm. sound for dead. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> so for you play vinyl, that's authentic, yeah, I mean. that's original. Mm. You know what I mean? So you have um. What, what, you have a name of a sound that you, that you did kill back then? Well, uh, there's one called Small Ox. Have you heard that name before? Okay. Yeah, that one come from, um, that song come from St. Mary. Okay. Can I remember that one? And I can remember one from Spanish Town. They call that one Wet Skin. Okay. You know what I mean? That, that was one of the song who I heard with the most bun to kill her. I never have any bone to kill at that time. <laughs> okay. But I use my knowledge and my skill and you know? Yeah. Show them say it's not all about one artist, you know. If you if you have it, can kill someone with anything they have. Mm -hmm. I mean and yeah and quite a few, I can't remember everyone, but I didn't make money I didn't put my mark down and make them know. I mean back then there was a song called City Rock. Yeah, and, and yeah, and there's one called Strike Force. Yeah, man, I remember Strike Force. Strike Force. Yeah, yeah. Strike yeah, Force yeah. was like my idol still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strike, Strike Force and Stone Love. Yeah, those were my idols. I used to go by Strike Force, wait on them for them battery mic to finish. <laughs> you know, they use the um, double contact battery, nine volts. Yeah. So I used to wait, and the, the guy used to select Strike Force and call him Bangaram. So I used to always say Bangarang because I used to ride this three-speed bicycle. See. And I and I used the battery to put the light on my bike. Okay. When you look at my bike, you talk about light, light at the front, light at the back. Yeah. So he always give me the battery them and even when it finished on the mic, I still have use for my lights. Because yeah. I buy the, the light them that carry less voltage. Okay. You know yeah, yeah. I mean? yeah, yeah. And always wait till the string up play. Sometimes we go there and strike force a string up and they finish play, you know what I mean? And me and Bangara, we get to become friends 
for the longest while until I leave Jamaica, but that was my favorite song. Yeah, okay. And at one point, I think Bangarang left, and it was run by the, the general called um, Amamot. Remember Amamot? Yeah. Yeah, and... Um, same artist, Amamot? <clears throat> Same, not the same artist. Yeah, artist Amamo. Yeah, yeah. yeah artist okay. Amamo. He was okay. he was the owner for that for Strike Force in, in the end. See, yeah, see, until he know. dropped out. And um, he actually called me to select the song. Yeah, yeah, man. I could have been one of the bad selector. Like maybe I could have been on Stone Love now. Okay. Because I was building my name. Yeah. Until yeah. I left, continue like. So yeah. was just was it always just Mikey or, or Mikey Dan or Super Mikey? Mikey? Just Mikey, not Dan, no, <laughs> not Nels to it, just Mikey. Okay, yeah, nice, nice, Mikey. Nice, nice. So, so when um so you came to England, what um when did you start Silver Links? I thought I think Silver Links about between two thousand and four to two thousand and six. Um I want to tell you I create Silver Link. Mm. I used to go to a college in um, Ibury and Islington. Okay. Because you know, everybody come here, we have to go all the school to yeah. make sure we think, you know, fix yeah, it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So I went to this, used to went to this college in Ibury and Islington, and um, I used to take the Silver Link line. Remember that train? Yeah, 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 man. I used to open it, and I was with this lady that she gave me the go ahead. Because, you know, in England, it's kind of a bit tricky when it comes to sound system. Yeah. Your neighbor and I like nice. Yeah, for real. So I was this lady and I said, you like nice? And she said, why? Me's a musician, I like music, you know. She said, okay, go ahead and have your music, man. And I start by them look them look a ham profile, if you can look at the one. So them they will start yeah. off with. Yeah, yeah. And a couple of my friends who know that I used to play sound back home, they said, well, I'm coming to a CD, you know. And take time, build my CD and to myself, what should I give my soul name? And actually pray about it. Yeah. Literally pray, yeah. like yeah. spiritually pray. Yeah. Ask God, yeah. you know, I'm, I'd like to own a son in England. And I pray about it. And as I come, I forward on the train one day back home and just see the big old silver links in that train. <laughs> and so, okay, then that sound good. Mm. I'm just full amp on it. Okay. I mean, a couple of years after the line, this yeah. man let me use it no more. Yeah, so it's right. kind of good for me as well. <laughs> you know what I mean, but yeah, um, that's where I actually build the name from, and from them, you know, just little bits and bops with friends, mm -hmm. trying to build by myself, build by myself, and you know, been through a lot, fight here, fight there, mm -hmm. fight here, but actually just basically paved the way for them still. Okay, you see me so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's that's, that's then. Mm -hmm. Great, great. So let's move on to MJ. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna give you some of the same questions. Okay. Yeah. Where was you born, brother? I was born here. Okay. Um. London. Uh, London mm -hmm. Woolwich. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And that was this place. Mm. I can't remember. Just, I can't remember. <laughs> Basically, the barn here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So when did you start playing music? I started when I was one, really. Quick question. How old are you now? Eight. Yeah. Wow. So you got seven years. You're seven years deep. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you started when you was one. Okay, so what, what what made you play music? So basically, yeah, I saw Dad playing it, and then like I asked him to play when like I was one, basically. Mm -hmm. And then Dad said, "When you get older," but then I saw Dad bought this new deck. You know the old ones that have. The um, what are they called again, Dad? Talking about the um CD deck, double, yeah, the CD. double deck, okay, double deck. Yeah. And then Dad let me have a go ahead with the double deck. I just use it, just mess around on it. Okay. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. So, would you say like your your, your daddy influenced you to be to be a, the little the little sound man that you are? Yeah. Yeah. 
Mm. That's perfect. Do you have anybody else that that you're into that you that you looked at and you said, I, I like that, you know. I, I want to be a little bit like him, like that. Like you see, everybody love love the um, strike force sound, but was was selectors or sound system? Well, influence. when I was five, yeah, when I was five, my dad just got some CDs, and then there was one the CD. I we always used to listen to in the car. Yeah. And it's Stone Love C D anniversary one. <laughs> okay. So that's why like I kinda like Stone Love. Okay. And yeah. Nice, nice, nice. A big influence, Stone Love. Yeah, but we all love Stone Love one of the best sounds and if you if you're following Stone Love, that's a that's a great education, that's a big thing, you know. Mm. Um Do you have like favourite songs? Like, 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 you see when you when you play music. Yeah. What's your three favorite songs that you like to play? You have do you have three favorite songs that you that you would like to play? Or I know you play a lot of music, but is there yeah. three that you say when I go out I must play this, I must play that, I must play the other? Well, I don't really like my favorite songs, but it's the songs that I know that's gonna mash up the place. So mm -hmm. like. Like, I don't really like these songs, but like, um, Skin Gunman and Chef. So, you know, our favorite song then, basically. Um, I have a favorite song. Okay. 16th Street. Okay. 16th Street, do you know who that song is, man? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Go on. Um, they also play. I have to also play any bone to kill off. Yes. Any bone to kill off. Okay. Yeah. So when you, when you see your selection, all right, because I know that you you play dubs, you play yeah. dub play, right? Yeah. I, I already see you in, in, in a musical sense. You kill your daddy. Mm. <laughs> I see that. One. <laughs> I see that one already. Oh yeah, I think I I take I take my tone back in a minute. <laughs> well, who 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 cuts your dub for you? Yeah, there's this girl in Jamaica called like, like, there's this girl in Jamaica that I have loads of people who cut that for me. Like, there's this girl in Jamaica called this Tishana, mm -hmm. and there's this, there's also someone who cuts the piece I forgot. I think it was some like, oh yeah, I remember now. Uh, a new famous, yeah. Oh, okay, famous. Well, that's the Sean and that, you know that. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, you know, all ain't famous, you know. Yeah. It's one of the top man in the world. Yeah. Tell you, um, but yeah. So you did, so so do you kind of do you hear the 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 forty fives and say, yeah, I'd like that, daddy, I would like that. How do we organize to get that in a double plate? Is that what you is that what you do? Yeah, but I don't really organize. I just like kind of remember some from artists and then ask them for that okay yeah oh, okay heard that you had a, a great experience with harry toddler mm -hmm. can you tell us about that a little well i met harry toddler when i was like seven yeah i met harry toddler when i was seven then i went to jamaica then and then also me and harry toddler like when I see him, like, it's always like a good one, like, mm -hmm. like how I, like, when I see Ari Toddler, he's just like always caring for me. That's nice. Yeah, and then yeah. like, how he always, you know, you know, yeah, gives me a go ahead on the decks. Okay. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. And my song was a help me with my song. Okay. Back to school again. You have a you have a song named Back to School again? Yeah. Yeah? Can I get a little piece of it? And a mm. few bars from that song there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't have to do it. Just give me a little piece of it. You don't have to give me the whole song. You give me give me the give me the whole the punchline and, yes. and a couple of words. Back to school again? Back to school again. 
Me and COVID can never be a friend. Mm -hmm. Back to school again, back to school again. Me and COVID, we never friend. Maths, English, literature. Don't forget your mask and sanitizer. That's all right. No one will be big up the teacher. Yeah. <laughs> he said, put up, put up, put up, put up, put up, man. man. Mm -hmm. So since you're talking about school there, um, if, do, you, do your friends know what you do at school? They know you play? They, yeah. they know you're a big bad selector or a little bad selector? Yeah, they just found out, you know. Yeah? They just found out because I did this thing, like UK television thing called um, Blue Peter. What, you was on Blue Peter? Yeah. That's big, man. That's big. And then the head teacher found out and then um, they sent it photos from it and then now ev then everyone found out and then everyone was I told everyone my YouTube page and then everyone started looking for my YouTube page. Okay. Page. Yeah. Okay. So your friends want you to play at their parties now? Uh, no, I haven't. Not yet. <laughs> not, not, yet. Yeah, not yet. But soon, most of it. Definitely it's going to be soon. They're, they're only just fine you know, so. Okay. So it okay. gets so keen, you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because I saw you play. I saw you play at the Dancing Clear Black History Month event at Stratford yeah. Town Hall. Really? Yeah. Right? And as the, you shell down the place. I mm. think out, out of all the sounds played, you was one of the greatest highlights. There was artists, there was many sounds, but you was a highlight. What did you think about that event? Well, it was a good event still. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I liked how there was loads of songs. I got to discover all the sounds, yeah. Okay. I also remember some people there. Mm -hmm. We were like that. Uh, Matt, Matty Emmanuel, okay. Diane Shiloh. Yeah. There was a big clash with JJ Sound. Okay. Yeah. If mm -hmm. I tell you, I can't remember any of that. I'll tell you a lie. <laughs> <laughs> you see yeah. why I'm going out? <laughs> mm, that's, that's, that's cool. That's cool because your performance was big. You know what I mean? You had everybody at the front dancing, mm -hmm. camera phones. So, you know what I mean? So, big select to everybody. It might be this size, but bigger than most. You know what I mean? And uh, they were like, you went to Jamaica and everything and played mm -hmm. so. Right, how did that go, brother? Felt good, yeah. So, the first time I could explain about the first time. Yeah. First time, me and Dad just wanted to go on a little holiday. So, like, me and Dad went on a little holiday. Yeah. Linked up Harry Toddler, did a Harry Toddler part, and then like after that, we mm -hmm, just went to the hotel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and also the next time was because of a funeral because my granddad died then. Oh, sorry to hear that, man. Yeah, and then so we did the funeral and then we went to a hotel. We went to one hotel, mm -hmm. which was called Bahia Prince. Okay. Yeah. yeah, and then there was one we went to when uh, me and Dad went. We went to the Cameron. The first time. Yeah, the first time. It mm. wasn't the other beach. It was Cornwall Beach. That one. So that's when yeah. you were playing music at the um. The yeah, camp. I played okay. the music at the Cameron. Okay, how did how did that how did that how did that turn out? Was it good? People love you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's good. Mm. That's good. Is there a difference for you? You see, when you're playing music in England and Jamaica, is, is, is the vibes the same or is the vibes are different? Well, kind of the same because I play. Yeah, the same because I play for like. Normally, I play for Jamaican people in England. Mm -hmm. So, like. I don't really play for like. You know, I don't really play for the. Um, the English people, I don't really play for them. Okay. Yet. It's kind of yet. The, not yet, but <laughs> it's kind of different. I'll mix it with different and the same, really. Kind okay. of different and the same. Okay, that's yeah. that's wonderful. That's wonderful. So now, let's bring the spotlight on because mm -hmm. Mikey, you got a lot of talented kids, my brother. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So we also have a young female selector. Yeah. And uh, you make you make music as well. You're a musician. Yeah, okay. I play instruments. What what's your what's your favorite instrument you play? Um, drums. Wow, you're on the drums. Yeah. Yeah. 
there's not many, there's not a lot of girl drummers out there, man. So, how long you been playing drums? Um, I'd say two years because I wanted to play it for my um, GCSE music. Okay. So, because piano I found difficult and I wasn't really as good at guitar, so I was like, okay. drums, but I still learn all of them now because oh. I like instruments. Okay, let me rewind. So, how old are you? I'm 15. Okay. Yeah, important, an important age at school, exams, right? Yeah? Okay, so, and music is one of your subjects? Yeah. Okay. So, wh where was you born? I was born in London, around Woolwich, like Greenwich area. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, I was making sure, because Pops was, bo was born abroad, so you, you're both English. No, me, me, me and Mum is still around Jamaican. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. And we're all the same with English. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> nice, nice, nice. So, you select sound as well? Yeah. Okay. Alright, so, um, have you played dances? Um, well, like, if there was somewhere, like, that we were booked to go, I would play as well, like, if there was, like, I, I like playing Afro beats because ah. I just like the, Af I like Afro beats. And That's like, nice. Um, so I like playing those. So like mostly I play that, or like I like playing like older music, but like Aretha Franklin, like disco. Okay. Um, okay. Like um, Amy Winehouse, like I like older music as well. So stuff like that I'll play. Okay, so so where where do you, where do you think that comes from? Where's that influence of music where you you play the the older set of music, the soul kind of vibes? Well, and the Afro I always heard I'd like playing souls like. But I also know my mum likes that music as okay, well. Yeah, yeah, and sure. like, I also hear my mum playing like R&B, like the 2000s R&B. Okay, yeah. So like those as well, I like that as well, because I got it from like them. Because I mostly get reggae from dad. It definitely but I get like the souls and like, because I hear him play it as well, because like, it's like a job as a DJ to yeah. know the music. But yeah. I like from mum, I would hear it. Okay. So, um... You 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 MC as well. You talk on the mic and not often. Sometimes I do. Okay. But like I'm quite shy, so <laughs> I just mostly mix and then okay. MJ will do that because yeah, he's like mind. really outgoing and um, yeah. sit in the corner and just read a book. Okay. So can you name me some? Uh, you, actually, you've named some of the songs. But when you when you play, this is a little question that we like to ask on Dancing Clear. Do you have like three favorite songs that you like to play? Um, well, as I said, I like the R&B, like the 2000, mm -hmm. so I like songs by Keisha Cole, okay, nice. or like um, the Mar Mario, he has like How Do I Breathe, or like those songs, so okay, that's nice. songs like that, yeah. Okay, and same way, did, did your friends know that, you, that, you, that you're that in a, in, a, in a big sound system <laughs> with, with your little brother and your father? Yeah, because... So whenever I like go on live, some of them check in and they're watching, and then at school they'll see me or just because I'm Jamaican in general, they just expect something to be going on. They're like, <laughs> okay. "Oh, Jamaicans are really hyped," and like yeah. they're like, "Oh, what are you doing at home?" So like you know, or well, they see my Instagram or they see okay. everything I'm doing, and they're like, "Your brother's got so many followers," and they're just following that. So. They are aware. Even some of them make jokes. They're like, "Oh, you're gonna play at my party, you know, five pounds in it." I'm like, "Don't know who <laughs> you're talking pounds. to." Yeah, that's so nice. yeah, that's they nice. are aware and they like, they talk about it. And they... That's a beautiful thing, man. Like, it's, like Mikey, you got a really talented family, my brother. Mm, really, me. really talented, thanks beautiful so family. You know what I mean? Met the little, the, the the latest edition, the new kid on the block. You see him as well. He look like he be coming into teams. Oh my God! Uh, I tell you something. Yeah, if 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 I'm um, when like when me and MJ finish come off live, he wants to go up there. Okay. And sometimes he sit there watching us and like, can I go, please? Can I go? <laughs> so as soon as we come off, we turn the system off. Mm -hmm. We like, I can't remember put him over it to start beat the sickness out of him. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, um, you know, there's the music is art and music is also love. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, and as Bob Marley would say, music alone shall live. Definitely. You know what I mean? So, if you can't feel music, then you don't have any feelings. Mm. You know what I mean? Aye. That's why I see it, so... Yeah, maybe a suckling can feel it as well, man. Yeah, Aye, yeah, yeah, bro. You know I mean? That's a beautiful way that we're going to wrap up this interview, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, Mike, thank you very much, my brother. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate MJ. it. MJ.
How do you pronounce your name properly? Ayla. Ayla. <laughs> Ayla, people. I didn't want to say it and get it wrong, okay? And together, they had a silver links family. You have any, like, do you want to give us your Instagram or your, your, your YouTube? I could do that. Go on then, brother. So we've got Ayla's one, Ayla dot. Ayla underscore. And Ayla underscore dot CG. That's our Instagram. Her YouTube is. And then do YouTube. <laughs> That's you. One YouTube. Go on. My YouTube is. Uh, li- little. Uh, little. And then you do a space and then links. Little C. Okay. Yeah, little space links. Yeah. And then we've got. Instagram. My Instagram, which is little links underscore K, and my dad's one is silver underscore links. And if people want us to do promotion for you, it's silver links promo. Nice. So to repeat your your Instagram account. Let me repeat my. Just yours, yeah. Just my. Okay. We've got no, no, little just. links underscore K. There you have it, people. One of the most talented families around. You understand? So, this has been Silver Link Sound, representing for Don Sinclair Reggae Vibes. So, big up yourself, Don, as I always say. You know what I mean? And don't forget to like, subscribe the video to the video. To, I'm sorry, to the channel. You understand? And check out all the content we got. You know, I mean? we got dance events coming up. We got so much. We got sound systems. You, you want to say something, bro? And respect and thanks to all the followers who is showing him all the love and the support. As a dad, I just appreciate all of you. Yeah. So, people, until the next time, I've been your host today for this dancing quick fire interview. Blessed love. Until the next time. Boom.